Hi, this is Blake with LawnEQ.com, and I had a customer come in yesterday and brought me a mower that is self-propelled, but working on his Toro Personal Pace lawnmower. Today I'm going to give you a couple things to, to look at, and usually this fixes the problem. Um, normally it's a belt that's come off, uh, something's flipped up in the from underneath and, and got behind the belt and threw it off. You want to first check underneath the lawnmower. And when you tip the lawnmowers back, you always want to tip them back on the handle. Um, your air cleaner is on one side, the exhaust is on the other. If you turn it this side, the oil is going to run into your air cleaner. You tip it on that side. So the proper way to do it is in a void on the back of the handle. Some of these have a quick release. You can set this up. Drop that in. And just tip it straight back like this and lay on your garage floor. And look at it. Now, if you come underneath here, look, this one's awfully dirty. But you can uh, check to see if this belt right here is on the pulley. There's a guard here. Um, but you can tell pretty quick. This one's on. So now that you've got that figured out, you'll set the more down. And you'll have to remove this back cover to check the back pulley on the transmission. It takes a 3 8 socket and you remove this back cover here I've already got this loosened up take this off and then you're going to check back here in the back and there's a pulley underneath this plate so you lift it up and uh, you can see that this pulley and the belt is not on the pulley so you'll need to take this cover off, which I have partially already did. I'm going to, I'm going to remove the cable, and basically it's just a clip. So you take two pliers underneath here and clamp it and pull it out. Unhook your spring, and then down underneath here, this is the hard part. You've got four, or I'm sorry, three screws here that hold this cover plate on the transmission. And they are a square head. We got a square head socket here to get these off. They're, the first two here are kind of easy to take off. Well, like I said, I've already got them loosened up. And I have sometimes, after you remove these front two, you can loosen the back and kind of squeeze that belt back on. The back one's the hard one. You actually push down on the transmission case, push it down so you can get in here to the very back one. And then you'll loosen it up. You might want to just leave it in. Rock this back to and put your belt back on the pulley. Once you, get, once you get the belt back on the pulley, you go ahead and put your two back screws back in and reassemble it and check it for the operation. If you have any questions, give us a call at LawnEQ.com or Barnes Equipment. It's 217-342-2909. Thanks.